You're doing everything right. You're getting regular exercise and enjoying the results as you raise your level of ability. Swimming, jogging, tennis, basketball, any sport that gives you a good workout is good for your physical and mental well-being. That is, until you overdo it. Then you may feel painful tennis elbow, Achilles and knee tendonitis, or rotator cuff problems. These are a few tendon inflammations that come from overuse and they can keep you on the sidelines for many months. Tendons are a specialized structure in the body that connect the muscle to the bone and it's through the tendons that the muscles work and allow the joints to move. And this is a very efficient mechanism except if a patient is very active and particularly if they're doing the same repetitive type of movements these tendons can sometimes get inflamed. When that happens, this is known as a tendonitis. It's a painful condition and it limits patients' ability to walk or to run or to use their arms. It limits their function. The symptoms are typically swelling, pain. It can sometimes be red and warm. Each year, millions of Americans are in a doctor's office due to tendon injuries. Yet, there is no reliable or consistent treatment for an injured tendon except rest, ice, and painkillers. Usually, from 3 to 12 months of rest are required before the inflammation subsides and daily activity can be resumed. The cost to society is great, as productivity in the workplace also suffers. One of the problems with tendonitis is that the patient can lose significant productivity at work, uh, even at home, because the pain is significant, which prevents repetitive motion. So the patients oftentimes have to wear braces, uh, splints, and they can't really use their extremity because of that. So millions and millions of hours of jobs lost, productivity is lost, and uh, people can lose their jobs as a result of this. When the patient has tendonitis that's refractory, they can actually get a tear. And once they get a tear and it becomes chronic, then the modalities we discussed don't really work. Then you're looking at steroid injections, and many times they fail. If that happens, now you're looking at surgery, which is really a big problem for the patient. When the patient needs surgery for a ruptured or torn tendon or partially torn tendon, this is a rather invasive procedure. The problem with that is sometimes it doesn't even solve the problem. The patient has a chronic disability. Recently, the FDA approved a pioneering treatment alternative to open surgery that eliminates these obstacles. The FAST procedure, short for Focused Aspiration of Scar Tissue, is an innovative treatment that releases and removes painful damaged tendon tissue in 15 minutes. The technology and procedure were developed by 10X Health, located in Lake Forest, California, in collaboration with the Mayo Clinic. The FAST procedure addresses the most common tendon pain, tennis and golfer's elbow, jumper's knee, swimmer's shoulder, Achilles tendonitis, and plantar fasciitis. This procedure is an adaptation of the procedure done for cataract surgery in which ultrasonic energy is used to remove tissue or to ablate tissue or to emulsify tissue. The characteristics of this particular application, which has never been done before, for the musculoskeletal system is that we can use just local anesthesia, the patient doesn't have to be put to sleep. The procedure can be done readily in an ambulatory surgical type of setting. It's very well tolerated. This uses conventional ultrasonic imaging to define or identify the problem area. There you see the black tissue right across the top. It's pretty extensive. And that black tissue is the, is, it represents the problem. Then using a very small incision, we introduce the probe, which is about the size of a toothpick. The probe, which delivers ultrasonic energy, is introduced under direct vision into the tendon that is diseased or is inflamed. This ultrasonic energy removes the disease tendon and this allows the body to begin to heal the area that has been involved. After the FAST procedure, the patient goes home and does not perform weight-bearing or stressful activity for two to three weeks. 
Within 6 to 12 weeks, most return to normal activities without needing physical therapy. Before the surgery, um, I've had this pain for about 10 years. I've had physical therapy, I've had braces for my wrists to wear at night, I've had a band across my arm to wear, I've been given stretches in physical therapy, I've had cortisone injections, um, taken um, numerous pain medications, and I just feel that now it's, it's over. This will be the last thing that I'll have done. The procedure was quick, relatively painless, and interesting to watch. What we have seen to date with this procedure is that it, first of all, it's very well tolerated. Patients have very little pain during the procedure. More importantly, it's quite safe. We have not yet seen a physician consult for a complication. So there's been no reported complications to date. Importantly also, it's effective. That is, about 90% of the patients get rid of their pain and are able to resume normal or near normal function. We feel as though this will be a very cost effective type of treatment, allowing people to get back to work. And I feel as though, and the company feels as though, this is an example of innovative medicine and application of technology at its very best. One of the most exciting opportunities with this new technology is that we think it can be used for internal scarring or bursitis and rather than treat this with a large invasive procedure using this small probe we think that we are able to really solve the problems that we have never been able to treat before. In the fields of sports medicine and orthopedics, safer, faster, cheaper and sooner are worth jumping through hoops to achieve. The FAST procedure is being rapidly adopted across the country. We're particularly pleased to have this new technology being done at the Florida Orthopedic Institute. Since this particular institution represents one of the highest quality orthopedic practices in the United States, the physicians at Florida Orthopedic Institute also are very interested in adopting new technology particularly new technology that works. That's why we're very pleased that they're interested in the FAST procedure. For more information, call 855-2-TENDON and visit 10xhealth.com.